They say helped Pryor flee that day after he ran from custody. Tonight, investigators zeroing in on friends and family to whom Pryor might turn for help and say they're in this hunt for the long haul. That's Action crazy. News reporter Annie McCormick live at police headquarters tonight. Annie, the message appears clear here. Anyone who helps this fugitive will face consequences themselves. 17. Absolutely, and we are told that a number of people have been questioned, questioned during this manhunt. Now, the U.S. Marshal said that they are prepared to expand. Yo, hold on, hold on, hold on. So we're going to get right back to the video. But if you want to know how to draw or paint like me, hit the like, hit the subscribe. If you want to support your boy and buy some of my merch, you know, I got information on that. Down in the description below, you can check out my store. I also got some new music coming out this Friday. So tap in, tune in. Show some love. I appreciate you. And let's get right back to the video. Hey, yo, gang, what's happening? It's your boy, Rain TJ, back again with another reaction video. Today, we're looking at this news clip about a murder suspect, bro. A teen, too, who actually got away. Like, he made some type of escape down here in Philly. So let's see what it's about. The big story on Action News tonight is the plea from police and federal agents as they work to track down that teenage murder suspect, now a fugitive for more than 48 hours. Hmm. And the longer Pryor stays on the run, the more desperate he becomes. This is brand new video U.S. Marshals say shows 17 year old Shane Pryor wearing a blue sweatshirt and distinctive hat hours after his escape on Wednesday morning. Today we also learned that police arrested 18 year old Michael Diggs here who they say helped Pryor flee that day after he ran from custody. Tonight, investigators zeroing in on friends and family to whom Pryor might turn for help and say they're in this hunt for the long haul. That's Action crazy. News reporter Annie McCormick live at police headquarters tonight. Annie, the message appears clear here. Anyone who helps this fugitive will face consequences themselves. 17. Absolutely, and we are told that a number of people have been questioned, questioned during this manhunt. Now, the U.S. Marshal said that they are prepared to expand their manhunt outside of Philadelphia. However, at this time, they do believe that he is still within the city limits. It's been more than 48 hours in the manhunt for accused murderer 17 year old Shane Pryor and tonight new video authorities say this video shows him inside an Alney corner store at North Masher and West Godfrey Avenue hours after the escape. He spent 10 minutes there. It's the last time Pryor was seen hmm. his ride. According to authorities was 18 year old Michael Diggs six hours after their Alney stop. Philadelphia police pulled Diggs over in Germantown in this tan Ford Fusion and took him into custody. Today, Diggs faces charges for his alleged role in his friend's getaway. Marshals Crazy. believe after prior escape from custody outside of the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia just before noon on Wednesday, he searched for a phone. He was denied a phone call at the front desk of another hospital building, then approached a woman on Civic Center Boulevard and asked to use her phone. That call led to Diggs arriving in the Ford. Right now, we're trying to shake shrink his world down. We're trying to cut off his resources. Pryor has been in custody for three years awaiting trial in the October 2020 murder of 54 year old Tanya Harris. His family says he maintains his innocence. Wait, hold on. He's 17 now or was he 17 when it happened? Because he'd been in custody for three years. If he was if he's 17 now, you telling me he a, he a suspect since he was 14 or did it happen when he was 17 and he a suspect the whole time um in custody the whole time and now he's 20 you feel me like what's his real age but how y'all feel about this y'all know anything about this i mean man's on the run that's always crazy whatever the reason Cause in today's day and age, bro, you can't get so far. You you could only go so far, bro. Like, look how quick they caught your partner, bro. How they even find him on that, you know, part of the highway or whatever. You feel me? Like, they got too much cameras around. They got the tech just crazy, bro. Like, you gotta come real good to be on the run, bro. Like, look how they found you. Found this video, son. They found this video in days, maybe hours, bro. Like. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Thanks for watching today's video. And you already know, if you like the drawings to the side, hit the like, hit the subscribe. 
Uh, I feel like if I get to 2,500 subscribers, I'm gonna stop doing reaction videos, like, completely. Don't give a damn. She take it like a real warrior. She take it like a real champion. She take it like she'll stand up on the face, not the devil on the skate, and she don't give a damn.